Zond 6, a formal member of the Soviet Zond program and unmanned version of Soyuz 7KL-1 manned moon flyby spacecraft, was launched on a lunar flyby mission from a parent satellite 68-101B in Earth parking orbit. The spacecraft, which carried scientific probes including cosmic ray and micrometeoroid detectors, photography equipment, and a biological payload, was a precursor to a manned circumlunar flight which the Soviets hoped could occur in December 1968, beating the American Apollo 8. However, after orbiting the moon Zond 6 crashed on its return to Earth due to a parachute failure. Mission. Zond 6 was the official designation for Soyuz 7 KL-1S, N-12. It was supposed to photograph the Moon in color and in black and white from 8,000 km and 2,600 km ranges, then return to Earth, landing at Tyratum only 16 km from the launch pad. It had been a long and difficult road to develop the L-1 guidance system, but it worked perfectly that time. Zond 6 flew around the Moon on 14 November 1968, at a minimum distance of 2,420 km. Photographs of the lunar near side and far side were obtained with panchromatic film. Each photo was 5 by 7 in 130 by 180 mm. Some of the views allowed for stereo pictures. The photos were taken from distances of approximately 11,000 km and 3,300 km. However, only one negative was recovered from the camera container. Zond 6 used a relatively uncommon technique called skip re-entry to shed velocity upon returning to Earth. A few hours before re-entry, on 17 November 1968, a faulty O-ring rubber gasket caused the cabin to depressurize, killing all the animal test subjects aboard. Zond 6 of parachutes also deployed too early and it crashed in Kazakhstan, near the designated landing area. For propaganda reasons the Soviets claimed the flight was a success. A state commission investigating the crash later determined that the coronal discharge effect which caused the parachute to jettison would only occur at the 25 mm capsule pressure. If the capsule had been completely depressurized to a high vacuum, the accident would not have occurred. <laughs> Details Launch date, time, 10 November 1968 at 19 hours 11 minutes and 31 seconds Coordinated Universal Time On orbit dry mass, 5,375 kg Topic. See also 1968 in spaceflight Topic. External links Zond6 in Astronautics. Com. This article was originally based on material from NASA NSSDC information on Zond6.